it's with great delight that i want to introduce sulai sulai is someone very special sulai is just not just ranked 6 in neat as a surgical uh, group 2023 but he's also a faculty in such as and what can get better than that and for me that is truly amazing uh, he has been the quintessential such as user teacher he has been a major part of our daily test and discussions uh, daily life twenty edition updates and he has managed to secure rank 6 and i think that's a wonderful achievement thank you sulai how do you feel thank you thank you thank you so much obviously first of all a huge thank you to you for letting me be a faculty of such test and i'm really really very happy uh, to be a part of it and very happy for my rank as well obviously <laughs> great buddy great so uh, sulai um, the audience wants to know more and they want to know where you about a lot more about you so tell me more about yourself tell me where you did your ug uh, yeah. pg and everything right. so i'm basically from uh, amdabad so i did my ug from bjmc civil amdabad and then my pg from kn in bombay and yeah i did my sashab also in kn only just finished off last month or so and then i came i need so so like comes from obviously great pedigree and uh, the fact is that i know uh, yeah. some of uh, sulay's teachers in kem as well and let me tell you they sing pians about him they say that he's one of the best people <laughs> to come out of <laughs> kem and i'm not joking because for someone in kem to say that uh, this guy is like absolutely amazing now that is something for sure uh, all the all the kem is really very really welcoming when it comes to academic services so they are really good faculty over here I was lucky enough to have one of the best faculty with me too Great, great. So, sir, tell me why uh, surgical oncology, or what do you want to do actually? To be honest. Yeah. So, uh, initially, I, I was bit, a bit confused between GI and surgical oncology, and uh, as most of the candidates who's appearing for NEET SSR, there are okay. both pros and cons to it. And primarily, everyone is drawn to GI or onco because of the fact that <coughs> in today's day and life, general surgery is more about GI or onco. You hardly see in today's day neuro or CVT or pediatric for that matter. So that is another thing. Most of the people, even the top rankers, if you see, most of them are picking up surgical GI and all. But for me specifically, I always used to love the fascination about the pathophysiology of how cancer, uh, a tumor works, and the, the the joy when you get an R zero section margin and all those things that always have been there for my mind. So that is primarily why like on cover GI. Both of them are fantastic answers. I don't know about it, but yeah, that's my thing. Great, Sulay. I think I think Sulay is also very erudite man. So, uh, so like someone who with whom I can discuss a lot more than surgery. So, yeah, uh, uh, <laughs> so, so that it's it's been particularly amazing. So, like, tell me a little bit about your preparation. Uh, how did you go about? What was your strategy? Yeah, yeah. So, uh, so to be very frank to all the viewers, I have given my need last year also. To, I not prepped a lot. Just the routine prep that uh, while MS uh, exit exam we gave. And I got a I got a pretty good rank. I got a rank of two fifty two, so it was a good enough rank. But I chosen not to take up, frankly, because of the thing that I wanted to give a full preparation months and not really prep a lot. So uh, apart from the prep that we do during PG, uh, if I say frankly, for anyone to prep in a nice way and get at least a double digit rank, if not a single digit rank, you need I would say two to three months in a good way. Then, depending upon your quality, you can can cut down to forty five days also. I myself started reading on and off in the past last year or so, but again, as I said, I started reading uh, point to point and pre- preferably with the mind, in, with the aspect in mind that I have to prepare for need uh, in July or so, so July, August, September, three months or so. And for anyone, there are two things very that are most important. One is the textbooks that you have to follow, standard textbooks, daily submission for need, and Question bank. Without questions, you cannot, you cannot, cannot just just keep on reading on and on because unless you test yourself, you cannot be very sure about what you have read. So I gave maybe around two reads, two maybe two and a half reads, two reads in our revision, and solved the question bank at least once, a few things twice, and obviously a few tests here and there. But it's not that difficult. So just let you all of them know it's not that difficult at all. Uh, it's not like. Usually, days I do read on and on and on. I do read consistently for two, two and a half, three months. Textbooks, one read. MCQs, one read. More or less, the second read. Revise what you feel difficult. That is all you need. 
fantastic fantastic uh, so uh, so like so um i mean you were obviously a big part of the video lectures which we took in searches as well so i'm not going to ask you how you use a video lecture so you were using it obviously you were teaching in it uh, <laughs> uh, and uh, in fact you recorded a couple of video lectures as well for us so that was that was a great learning point for you as well for sure but uh, okay. tell us a little more about how the search test question bank played a role in your preparation okay definitely so the search test question bank apart from the video lectures have a very specific mix of things that are important to understand concepts the videos will help you understand very difficult or very tricky concepts which you may not understand at all but you don't need to see all the videos use videos selectively whenever you want but question banks you have to go from cover to cover what's important it it's, it's a mix of the standard textbooks bailey sebastian schwartz and the sub specialty and specific points from those topics for example if you take things like simple things like neurosurgery as edh sdh the simple criteria of neurosurgery edh and sdh are not given in all books but they are there in the question bank similarly cardiovascular similarly pediatrics so that sub specific important topics and not everything not cover to cover you not like covering everything there is a very good thing in search test and secondly the explanations help you understand the concept in such a way that you don't need to read go and back and read the textbooks again you can just read maybe take some time off and then do the question bank and then it helps in kind of a revision so if you do a question bank once and read twice three revisions that's all great 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 so i think that's pretty insightful um, review of these such a question man and uh, i must take personal pride in it cuz i was involved in answering some of these questions yeah, so thank you sulai i think uh, it's been pretty insightful uh, so sulai um, what advice so a lot of students have not been able to do get a good rank in neat tests this time and a lot of people are giving it for the second time third time so what specific advice do you want to give them so uh, one thing that i would tell all of them out there is start off with the basics first if you have, a lot of people i've seen they go on and start doing direct mcqs direct videos those things are important but these are supplemental to your basics so this is a very frank advice i would again be that start reading bailey and sabestian at the first go for neat for ian it's a different thing for neat ss bailey sabestian are based the mcqs help you reinforce the concept so if you do only mcq there are people are telling me that i've done all the question banks still are not able to score good it's not either or you have to read the textbook understand it and then the concepts are consolidated with the help of mcqs so it goes in that manner you don't need a lot of time to do it you need again maybe two reads and a revision to do it uh what's the trick is you have to spend the last 15 20 days full on without doing anything take leave take time off in the revision of the question bank and whatever notes you have made that is very essential and that changes your rank from something for getting something in the range of let's say 500 to 100 rank. that is very essential that's that's insightful sulay uh, so sulay uh, how many hours a day did you study or like what was your schedule especially like because i know that you were also working and uh, yeah. preparing so was it difficult or was it hard uh, to do it to the job so uh, yeah so as i said you need i think so at least two weeks off the last two weeks take leave or whatever what is convenient to you maximum number of hours that you can spare the last two weeks apart from it i would say from the last 50 days or so you need to read at least six to six hours or so before that according to your preparation if you never read daily never read sabiston never started even you start even earlier may let's say Maybe give one or two months more. Read two, three hours a day, four hours a day. You don't need to read every day. Read and sort it out and follow it up with MCQs, twenty, thirty MCQs, forty MCQs. Not more than that. You don't need to do in the initial part. In the end part, obviously, you need to do at least at least fifty, sixty MCQs. If hundred, that is good. But if not, at least fifty, sixty MCQs. Number of hours day is very flexible for everyone. So I cannot say itna padho, itna mat padho. But definitely, in the end, fifteen, twenty days, give yourself. good time don't go around don't work as far as possible take leave great hey thanks ali i think uh, it's, it's 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 wonderful uh, because it's like homecoming you know uh, uh, i i, I, I you always been in the other part where you you are teaching and now you're there this and i'm yeah, incredibly yeah. happy and proud and all again you thanks to you personally vinayak and search test for all the preparation all the help you gave and for everyone out there i would just like to tell you it's it's not that difficult just give your 100% for maximum 30 40 days it will be more than enough to get a good enough good rank 
then the rest is upon destiny a few things are upon luck definitely yeah it is incredible so like it is incredible uh not just me but the entire search test team uh ankur is there recording the video super was there in the office gopi just came back from work we are all excited and happy for you the entire search test team is having a party because you won today and 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 i can tell you that it, it feels amazing for the entire team because it's like one of us won so okay. thank you so much sir uh, thank you sir i'm like i'm sure you are too uh, thank you so much